Hello everyone, welcome to Femacy Lighthouse. This reading is for the sign of Scorpio. To book a private session, all of that info can be found in the description box of this video. We're gonna be taking a look at the recent past, the present, and the future. Please keep in mind, not all of these readings are in reference to a lover. This could be in reference to a friend, a family member, or a coworker. And not every person watching is going to identify with these messages. All right, let's take a look. Spirit, please speak to me in reference to the recent past when it comes to an energy that Scorpio thinks about. Please speak to me in reference to the recent past. The recent past for Scorpio. So some of you guys heavily think about a Pisces energy. Not all of you guys. But I definitely feel like this person right here, they view you as their wish. This person feels like you are everything that they once wanted and even more. It's like they want to pursue goals with you. They still feel you even if you're not around them. Your spirit is just all around them is what I feel. You know, they also want to have more conversation with you. I feel like this is not somebody that you're in an exclusive relationship with. This is somebody that wants to get to know you better. All right? That's what I'm getting here. Tell me more. Talk to me. Even more Pisces energy coming out here, Scorpio. All right? So I don't know if you're dealing with another water sign, but this person, they don't speak up a lot. They don't like to talk to a lot of people about what they're going through. And if they could tell you everything that's going on, I feel like they would. For some reason, they feel like they can't, okay? Tell me more. Talk to me about the recent past. The Three of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. I feel like this person, you could have met them at work or you have something in common with them when it comes to your interests, the hobbies that you have, the things that you like to do. You could have met this person outside or at some place is what I'm getting. I just feel like, you know, it was outdoors is what I'm getting, you know, um, some sort of outside festivity. You might have been out that night and just met this person or something like that. Okay? Tell me more. You could have went out because of some sort of work situation, something that had to do with your work, and therefore you came in contact with this person, and it's like you hit it off with this person right away. Tell me more about the recent past. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, you definitely have a water sign here, okay? This person doesn't have to be a water sun sign, but they could definitely have water in their chart is what I'm feeling here, okay? A lot of Pisces energy. Now, let's take a look at the present. Spirit, please talk to me about the present when it comes to Scorpio, and this energy that Scorpio thinks about. The magician with Gemini, Aries, Virgo energy. I feel like this person wants to have a new experience with you. I feel like you're looking for that as well. All right. It's like I get this energy from you detaching from anything from the past. It's like you want to explore other options. And it's like, I don't get you in a low vibrational energy. I feel you actually seeing that there is other possibilities. And I feel like this person, they're encouraging you because I feel like you and this person have a lot in common when it comes to your struggles and any of the issues that you've had with past partners which is what's eventually going to bring you and this person together. All right, so you have a lot of new energy coming in here. Tell me more about the magician in the present for Scorpio. 
the magician. Tell me more. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. If you are looking for a new person, Scorpio, I would definitely suggest a Pisces energy, okay? I feel like this is something that's very exciting for you in the present moment. Something has you a little anxious, but in a good way, all right? This person is just as excited. So maybe you're going to be meeting up with this person pretty soon, or you guys have made plans. You know that this person is going to be at a certain place at a certain time. Hmm. Tell me more about the present for Scorpio and this energy. The star. Wow. Yeah, so something ends so that you can have this new beginning with someone. I feel like you could have been telling yourself that something is over when it's not. It's only getting better for you, Scorpio, is what I get here. And we have all of this attention that you're getting in the present moment, which takes you out of feeling that something ended for you. It's like you have someone here that is making you feel welcomed. This person is making you feel like nothing ever ended. All right. You could have had someone in the past that made you feel like something was done for you. And that's just not true in the present moment. There's something new happening here, a new experience. And you're very, very happy about it and excited. OK, now talk to me about the future when it comes to Scorpio and this energy, please. Talk to me about the future for Scorpio and this energy. So we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and we have the Three of Swords. So there may be this other energy that you need to let go of because I feel like there's somebody else or something else. If this is in reference to love, I feel like there's somebody else that you want. And so therefore you have to cut somebody else out. And this person that you cut out, they're not going to be, you know, in the best mood here with the three of swords. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, a Virgo, all right, a Taurus even. Um, but there's some sort of painful situation here of you kind of cutting somebody out from the past so that you can pursue something new. Okay. Tell me more. You have somebody waiting for you, Scorpio. They're waiting for you to acknowledge them. But I see that you obviously have options here, right? You have either a Libra, a Gemini, Aquarius, or a Capricorn, a Virgo, that you probably need to distance yourself from because there's another water energy here. And it feels like a Pisces. And that's what I'm getting here. Maybe you had a strong connection with a Pisces from the past or something like that. But it feels like a lot of water. Yeah, you know, this person, this other water sign, I feel like they're waiting, Scorpio. Somebody's waiting on you. Someone is left alone here and they just want you to come back. And I feel like you are coming back. If you're separated, you're definitely making your way to this person here. So what's the advice for Scorpio? What's the advice for Scorpio? You're definitely going to give to this person. You know, the advice here is to go for it, basically. The King of Cups to the Ace of Pentacles. So you are definitely wanting to participate in some new opportunity. And I see you leaving another connection behind, okay? And if you're looking for new love, I definitely suggest a Pisces energy or a Cancer is what I'm getting. 
All right, that's what I have for you, Scorpio. Thank you so much for watching. To book a private session, all of that info is below. Take care.